Hey everybody, long time no see. I know it's been a while, but I took a, uh, a couple years off there. But um, you guys are staying with me. I'm getting new subscribers every day. And in, in, in fact, I just went over 4,000 subscribers recently and over 1.3 million views for, so in honor of all that, I thought I'd come back on here and do a little chat, chat and channel here and update and let you know what's coming up. Coming up. So, and while I'm doing that, um, I'm going to show you my bottle shelf here in the kitchen. This is a shelf over our kitchen in, in uh, where we keep all these special bottles that we find. Either because we like the name or we like the product. So, um, we start off with the, this first bottle down here is, uh, is OBX beer. Uh, OBX is an abbreviation for Outer Banks, which is right near where we live. So, that's kind of why we like the bottle there. And then, how could you not like an ale called Arrogant Bastard? Same thing for Dogma. We like that one too. Also Dirty Dicks. And then the Lucky Buddha, the green one here. Um, I always try to make it a point to drink a Lucky Buddha on, on New Year's Eve and New Year's Day to start off the New Year lucky. And then for you Harry Potter fans, this is um, some butter beer that we found. Decided to keep the bottle too. And over here we have the Red Oak and the Humminbird Hellas. Both of these are really good beers that we like with this uh, from local beer brewery here and They're really good if you find them if you find some around somewhere give them a try. They're really good also The Caleb's Cola this is the precursor to Pepsi Cola um, It which was founded here where we live it was Pepsi Cola was born here by Caleb Bradham and That's why this is called Caleb's Cola. This is after him so and it's also really good <laughs> So we tried that and kept the bottle. Next we have the 7-Up bottles featuring the Indiana Hoosiers. I think that's from the 80s. And the next to that is the other one. The, um, I think that one's from like 78 or 79. And that's one in the end with a little Irish man in the middle of it is from 77. I used to have a full bottle of that with it capped off and, er capped off and everything. But it got knocked off the shelf. And hit the floor and shattered and my wonderful wife felt so bad about that she went on ebay and got me not just one more one bottle to replace that but a whole entire eight pack that she found on online on ebay but it had a friend of ours pick it up where it's being where it's being sold at because they would only have do pickup only so she picked it up for us and then she had it shipped to us and you can see the tag on here it's, it's eight an eight pack for 89 cents is that incredible or what it's got the old retro box to it with also and the, the sale take it there um and this it's eight of these bottles so it was just really awesome for her to do that so i apologize for the shakiness but i'm standing on a ladder in my kitchen i didn't feel comfortable in the chairs Anyway, to continue on, we have the Sarnaks down here, the Sarnak Growlers. We like them because they're big growler bottles. We got the Pumpkin Ale, the S'mores, and the Holiday Ale. And they're, they're all pretty good except for the S'mores. The S'mores, um, we don't really care for. So, anyway, that's our bottle shelf. Our special bottle shelf. And to let you know, we got some videos coming up. We already got like three or four in a can ready to re be released. So. I'm gonna get back on a horse and kick this thing off and get my channel going again. But I wanna thank you for all you thank you all for your support. It's really appreciated. And I just wanna leave you guys hanging anymore. So I'm gonna get back into it. Okay, if there's anything you guys would like to see me do or, or something you wanna know about or you'd like to see a video on, let me know in the comment section. And we'll try our best to get it done. Um, Always looking for things to present themselves around here to provide us an uh, opportunity to share a video with you. Things are happening more and more every day, so um, that's just the joys of home ownership. Always got to fix something. So, um, hope to see you soon, and make sure you stay tuned and come back and see what we do next.